Vanessa, what does ambition mean to you? Yeah, it's such an interesting question because it's loaded in so many ways, right? But to me personally, I think it's, it's much more just about believing in myself and just knowing that, that what I'm doing is going to make an impact on me and it's going to make an impact on the people around me that I care about and that I love. And if, if my ambition is just to create happiness in my life and, and the people that I can influence with that, then to me, then I've been successful. I don't think it's being extremely wealthy or creating a lot of uh, wealth personally. If I can create uh, diversity and inclusion and, and just a sense of uh, belonging to a larger group of people, and wealth gets created because of that, <laughs> then I feel like I've been truly successful. So do you see yourself as ambitious? Wow. I've just been in a group of these amazing women <laughs> um, in the year of uh, PhDs and startups and, and, you know, gosh. To be honest, I don't think so. I just, I, I feel like I've been able to follow... Uh, opportunities but I've also been able to notice that opportunities have existed so I think it's uh, being aware of what's around you and just taking advantage of the things that make sense for me at a certain period of time and I think there's a combination of being strategic and planning those things to be <laughs> successful but also just taking opportunities when they come to you but also having the ability to know what those opportunities look like. So, so you see yourself as good at spotting things? I feel like, yes, I was in a career where I was good at spotting things and, yeah. you know, I was an industry expert in a certain, certain area of the technology markets and uh, I was able to pull together complex technology trends and, and articulate what those things meant in a, in a, in a more consumable way. Um, so, effectively, yes, but I think we can all do better at that. Can you describe for me the most ambitious person that you know? Gosh. Um, yeah, a good friend of mine here in, in San Francisco, actually, uh, he's also a fellow Kiwi, and I think his ambition has come from just knowing that he wanted to change his personal situation. So he grew up in a you know, not so great environment, a single mom, and they didn't have a lot of money. And his, his drive, ambition was to just make sure that he had enough around him money-wise, but also he was successful enough to, so that those things didn't matter anymore. And what he was creating uh, for his family was different than the situation that he was raised in. So his ambition was directed towards creating opportunity for the next generation, which is very interesting. Is there anything that would enable you to be more ambitious? Honestly, if, um, I don't think so right now. Um, I, I think I'm pretty happy with, with how I've been growing. I think one thing that would help is just, you know, tapping a, a, a network of champions because you know we all we all have uh, we're a bit of negative energy a lot of the time and sometimes you know, we really just need to have people around us that are positive and, and can help us grow through uh, the situation so I, I wouldn't necessarily call it ambition but I would call it uh, personal growth and development. <laughs>